we've seen a lot of great endings. Where does this one rank there with that catch from Mike Trout? Well, that's, uh, you know, just shows what Mike's been doing all year and what he's been doing in center field for us. And to end a game like that, lead off a game with a home run, and end by taking one away is something special. What do you have to say about the way the outfielders pretty much set their presence on the defensive side right from the first inning with Torrey Hunter? Well, that was, that was huge. Uh, starting with Torrey and then going to, um, you know, when Vernon did the left field, it was incredible. He went, uh, you know, from the gap down to the line. That range in the outfield showed up, and, uh, you know, and yeah, Mike in center. So, uh, you know, the defense is a big part of what we need to do, and tonight it showed up. C.J. Wilson, what are the biggest things that you saw today, especially with the strike ball ratio and the proportions? Oh, much better. I think that he was, um, you know, he, he got uh, lost the release point a little bit, got behind some counts, but for the most part was in the zone early, was getting contact on his terms. Um, a couple balls were hit on at, at people, but that's going to happen. Uh, and for him to pitch in the eighth inning, uh, it gives us a big lift. In that case, were you looking at the pitch count? Before you got him out, and got him out from that time. Well, he hasn't been up that high in pitch count his last, you know, for a while when he was struggling, and um, I, I think that um, it was a good part, part, you know, good, just a good place in the game to to let him, uh, you know, get out of the out of the game. He had been battling a little blister his last start, and um, he he pitched well. Like I said, the pitch into the eighth against that is it can mean you have to hit your spots well. How happy are you to see continuity with the offense against a guy like Burnham? I'll tell you what, with, with Berlander, if you don't get him early, you're not going to get him. You can see as he heated it up, it heated it up um, and he, was, he was making some terrific pitches as the game went on. But fortunately, we got a lot of damage done in the first inning. And um, uh, you know, Mike started off with a big hit. Kendrys, Albert, everybody followed suit. Howie with a big hit. Uh, those four runs were huge tonight. And as we said, against you know, Justin Berlander, if you're going to get him, you better get him early because he. Uh, if he stays in the game and he smells it, uh, he finishes strong. And tonight, fortunately, we've got some early runs on the board. Mike, are you ever in awe of some of the stuff that you've seen Um I think we're past being in awe. It's just a you know talented young player um, you know, playing at a high level, and that's what we're seeing. And he's doing it consistently. So um, he's playing. Uh, He's doing things he's capable of doing. CJ, the last few outings, how much does that go back to what you kind of talked about a few outings ago with it? Just <laughs> keeping it simple and attacking the strikes and not trying to do too much. I think he did a great job. I think um, he was in the zone early for the most part. Um, threw some good breaking balls uh, and, and some counts to get guys out. But uh, I think I think he, he, he commanded uh, both sides of the plate. Good movement on his pitches and uh, was aggressive in the zone, and that's that's when he's at his best. His efficiency really paid off. I mean, he, I don't think he had been that deep into a game since no. June for a while. Yeah, yeah, he's um, <clears throat> he's been struggling to find it, and uh, you know he he's been uh, last couple starts is starting to come together. It's the best all-around baseball you think you guys have played all year in terms of just the early runs, the pitching, the relievers, the starters. Uh, well, our, our, our offense has been consistent. It's, it's, I don't think you can find much fault in where uh, you know where our offense was since probably early May to now. They've been doing a terrific job. We've been pressuring clubs, uh, running the bases well. Uh, you know, our situational hitting has really picked up. Now that we're 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 uh, you know combining that with the pitching that we expected, um, you know, it's, it's easy to say we're playing at a high level. Um, uh, we were playing very well through uh, you know June and early July too, so it's tough to say you know what, what your best is. But we're uh, you know we're, we have, uh, our pitching has definitely picked us up here in the stretch. What does it say to you about the fact that they're doing it at this time of the year right now? I wish they were doing it a month ago. I think we, you know we, we um, you know we're trying to keep pushing forward, and uh, we're glad they've. Um, you know, they're starting to throw the ball with the consistent consistency that they can. You know, they're a talented group of pitchers, and they've uh, you know they struggled for a while. So uh, it's here now, and, and, and hopefully it's going to continue because we need it. Is there a key to getting the Verlander early in games? Sometimes he'll have these first innings. Yeah, I don't know. If there's a key. You're trying to get him every inning, whether he's throwing, right. you know, whether he's trying to work his way into his game. As the game goes on, you know, you, you see him working his way into his stuff, his velocity. And um, he's one guy, you know. If you, if you, um, you know, if he, if he gets, uh, gets it going, and he starts to smell, uh, a, you know, a, a win, uh, 
he's very, very tough to beat. So early runs against him are important. What do you see in uh, Vernon right now? I mean, confidence offensively, defensively, he seems to be playing what you guys probably expected. Well, defensively, he's always been there for us. Offensively, obviously, uh, he's, he hasn't performed to the level that he had when he was with Toronto. Uh, but, you know, he's he's a much better player than than uh, than he's shown here in the last uh, year and a half. And hopefully he'll give us a lift here down the last month. Can he earned his way back into semi everyday role. Well, any time, any you 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 know you play better, you're gonna you're gonna get more opportunities to help uh, you know help to help the team win. And, and Vernon is, um, you know, although he wants to play every day, he's accepted whatever bats he's going to get. And he's working very very hard to stay sharp and contribute. And you know, big hit today with the two outs to get another run home in the first, and then. Uh, I mean, his defense, so he went, he put cap the line, that's a long way uh, for him to cover it. Just shows he still has that uh, closing speed to make plays in the outfield. Are you talking about the ball left center or the one down the line? He, he went the gap to the line. You know, the line. That's what I'm saying. He went yeah. way into the gap to take that hit away from the front and then down the line. He, he went a long way too. Thanks, Mark. What does it say about your roster when you have a guy like that that doesn't play every day, but when you call upon him, he responds? Well, you know, we, we're, we're uh, yeah, we have a little bit of depth, and you know, obviously with Mark Trumbo struggling and some other guys that were banged up out for a while, you know, he was out. Yeah, you have to have that depth to be able to absorb it. And uh, you know, Vernon's one of those guys has come on and played well, and uh, uh, you know, we have to have that deep look if you if you're going to get through a season and reach your goals, and it's 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 good to have it now. Uh, he's got a little. Um, a little cost to strain, uh, um, and, you know, it's day to day, so we'll see. Did he get a turn in a double play? I think, he got, a, double yeah, play? I think he got a swing in. That's what he said, swing in the back. Thanks.